Welcome back to Ramsey Land. Today I want to show you the classic combustion reaction between potassium chlorate and red phosphorus. Check this out. All I'm using in this investigation is potassium chlorate. I'm using the red allotrope of phosphorus, a ceramic crucible, and this is my extendable plasma wand. Begin by measuring half a gram of potassium chlorate and the same amount of red phosphorus. Okay, once you have an equal amount of red phosphorus and potassium chlorate, this is about half a gram of each, you're gonna very carefully mix this back and forth. These are both very sensitive to shock, so you don't wanna grind these in a mortar pestle. You just wanna very, very gently layer the two together until you have a nice, even mixture. Once you have a nice, even mixture, you're ready to pour it very gently into your crucible. Okay, and now we're ready to test it on our ring stand with a small plasma deflagration wand. Well, as you can see inside my blast shield, that little crucible was no match for that reaction. It was literally blown to bits. So this reaction is very similar to what happens when you strike a matchstick on the side of a box of matches. The match head is predominantly made of potassium chlorate, and the striker panel on a matchbox is made of the red allotrope of phosphorus. So just the friction between the potassium chlorate and the red phosphorus strikes the match. Okay, let's see how loud this is. This is just less than a quarter gram. Oh, more of a whoosh. <laughs> Here's the balanced equation for this combustion reaction. We start with 10 moles of potassium chlorate, that's the 10 KClO3, and we add that with three moles of red phosphorus, that's the 3P4. And after careful mixing, if we add a little activation energy from our plasma wand, we get the product three moles of tetraphosphorus decaoxide, that's the 3P4O10, and 10 moles of potassium chloride, that's the 10 KCl. I hope you enjoyed today's edition of Ramsey Land, and I'll see you next time. If you enjoyed this presentation, be sure to remember to like and subscribe.